positioning of Ali Canning and DJ is a very interesting one. And here's a chance for Eddie Brennan! It should have been cleared. But when you have an opportunist sniffing around the edge of the square, then it's trouble with a capital T for Galway. This should have been cleared. It slipped inside, skidded on the surface, and Eddie Brennan's finishing was superb. Tommy Walsh picks it up, flicks it down over to the far wing. In towards Eddie Brennan, the goal scorer. Damian Joyce with him, giving a little bit too much space. Brennan turns and sends it over the bar. A goal and a point after four minutes. Reflected on the scoreboard, it must be said as well. Kenny doing well. And that half back line, JJ Delaney to Michael Kavner. Lofting it high up to Rosalind Larkin. Shane Kavner with him, and it's Brennan once more. And that's another point for the corner forward from Greg Pally Callan. And I think a change is now necessary if Galway are going to, uh, in any way, stop Eddie Brennan from having a match of the day performance. Eddie Brennan getting away from Shane Kavner. This is going to curl and it's going over the bar. Great point. A goal and three points Eddie Brennan has scored. Exactly the same amount that Henry Shefflin has scored. And this is the reverse angle camera and it gives you an idea of the distance that Eddie Brennan travelled here. Maybe Waterford and maybe as an outside chance, maybe Galway. Well, Galway have certainly come of age. This ball inside. Gathered by Comerford, does it? Eddie Brennan, it's a goal! This game is far from over. Kilkenny respond with two goals and three points by Eddie Brennan. This ball inside gathered. David Collins was right beside him, but the finish here was top class again.